Hi guys. Girls. Girls. Okay. So today I'm going to talk about my hair. And right now it's this long, short, length, whatever you want to call it. Um, yeah. As you can see, you can probably notice that my front, this is my natural hair. So it's like really curly and nice down here, but when you get up here, it's like what happened, like these awkward waves and stuff. Well, this is caused because, you know, um, I actually straighten this top area way more than I do at the bottom. So, yeah, that's why. So I'm going to talk about my hair and the products. Um, I've been trying to grow out my hair for so long and it just does not work out with me so I've been using I've been relying on products to help me to help my hair grow out so um let me get started first off my shampoo is this Pantene daily moisture renewal and I've been really liking this I've only been using it for half a month or so um and I really like it um it says, let's see, provides all day moisture, feel, and leaves hair soft, manageable, and strong against damage. And, yeah, it's pretty good against damage. I mean, my hair was pretty damaged before I got my, um, a trim, like, two months or three months ago. And, um, it's been really working. Like, it has kept my hair very healthy so far. And, um... I'm going to switch it up probably soon because I don't want my hair to get too used to it. So, yep, that's my shampoo. And then instead of conditioner, I've been using this um, hydrating macadamia oil. I got it at Walgreens. Not sure how much it was, but I will link it down below if I find it. And I want to say this smells like vanilla and coconut. And, yeah, as you can see, it's pretty used up. Um, I, it says that you can wear it for 20 minutes. You can leave it in for 20 minutes and cover it with a shower cap. But I usually shampoo my hair with Pantene. And then I leave this in for 15 minutes while I'm, like, shaving my legs or something. So, um, yeah, I usually just do this in the shower, not, like, you know, whatever. Okay. So, moving on, uh, hair serums, I've been using both of these, I actually bought this one the day I bought the macadamia oil at Walgreens, and this one I bought it at Sally's, and this is a, um, carrot growth serum, and, um, it has actually really, really, really helped my hair, I don't use it that much because I find that it leaves my hair kind of oily if I use it close to the roots, but, um, I try to use it down here, but I feel like it wouldn't make a difference since this is not where my scalp is at. So, um, I use it once in a while. And this one, well, yeah. This one, um, it's a glossing polish, color and heat protection by Proclaim. And, um, it says it helps eliminate frizz, helps straighten hair, um, adds luscious look whoa I don't know what that says um I guess it adds shine and um protection against heat damage so yeah I really like this I use this instead of actual heat protectant like spray because I don't know why I just haven't bought sprays in a while and yep so then, I've also been using this. I started using this, like, three years ago, and out of a sudden, I just stopped the first year. And I really regret that because I've noticed that with this, my hair was really long and strong. Like, my hair is naturally thin, but back then, it was still strong. And it was because of this. And it was $1 at Walgreens. I don't know if they still sell it, but... They probably sell some other sort of coconut oil. And, um, I was really doubting this when I first got it because you get what you pay for it. And it's one dollar, so I wasn't, my hopes were really that high for this. But, 
I realized that, uh, okay, that, that, um, it actually really works, and I was pretty impressed. So, um, from now on, I will keep using this, I actually have this on right now, and I try not to go closer than, like, this much to my scalp, because I find that it leaves my hair really oily, and usually I leave this on before I go to sleep, but today I just felt like leaving this on like this, I don't know. So, um, yeah, I really like this, and if you have any other coconut oils that you recommend for hair, then please comment down below. And last but not least, um, baby powder. I love having baby powder where my hair products are at because I find that it's the best and most affordable thing to use when you have like a second hair day and your hair is a bit oily inside and you just, you know, grab a little bit of this, shake it up. So, okay, I just kind of spilled some. Um, and just uh, apply it to like your roots where you find it most, most oily and it will simply just make it, well not make it go away but it won't be as noticeable like come on away so um baby powder yes actually first time I used it it was really awkward because I'm like why is baby powder going in my hair like what but yeah I saw a lot of like gurus on YouTube that use this for their hair so um yeah so those were my hair products and so far routine for this month, which is March, I believe. So, um, yeah. Spring break starts today, right now. Right now, right now, right now. So, um, yes. I will see you guys later.